Hello everyone, are you ready for another adventure? It's me, Wokey, and I'm back with some more Fake Grand Order. Today, we're on... <laughs> we're on something. We're on Valley Artemis. It's round four, as we know, as everyone knows at this point, Desert Beauty did in fact win round three. This was my final count. So for today, it's just going to be a very casual grind as I kind of just do a little bit of this because I still have some... Uh, stuff to grind out yeah so that's gonna be today's video i hope you like it leave a like if you do comment about how your current grinding is going what teams you're going for stuff like that it's not gonna be uh much different from what you expect because again i have mainly scotty sure i'll go with you i think that'll work out it'll be a little bit tight i think but it should work fine yeah there we go man all right, let's get into it. We are, in fact, why is it called um, Valley Artemis? If you have not done the story, let me try and explain. Um, Artemis is the goddess of love, I think. Her bear boyfriend, who is Orion, is gone loose, and he's some kind of giant pervert. Um, and these boobs are supposed to be these mountain tops that look a lot like boobs huge in their just gigantic splendor in the back there. Um, what was I talking about? This is the only thing I was talking about, boobs. Anyway, um, point is is that all the enemies here are Artemis and we're trying to find the real one. That's the story behind it anyway. Alright, not bad for the first one. Let's see how the second one goes, though. Orion. See, so that's why a bunch of people have like Orion over their uh, top of their head right there. Is that? I just realized, is this not level 10? It is level 10. Okay, good. What is this? Just to com make sure it 100% is the way I want it to go. Oh, man. So, yeah, this is part 4, and then after we reach the end of this one, part 2 of summer is going to start. So, uh, get your grinding done now. Well, it's not like you can't grind part one, but chances are you'll be so busy with part two and advancing that that you'll want to try and, you know. I'm just saying, you might want to get um, your part one stuff just done in general. There we go. My Artemis is uh, not that... She only has a level five on her last skill. She's only NP1. She's just so insane at looping. It's like hilarious how good she is at good she is at it. Man, someone's phone went off. Um, you wanna know- okay, so here's the crazy thing that I wanted to talk about in the last video, but I decided to save it just in case they decided to come after me. Um, so I did a Desert Beauty video, and I don't know if you were there for when the first cover was up. Um, it was a cover of Naito in her swimsuit along with Sherazade, who wears something that looks like a swimsuit. Anyway, they were just like sitting next to each other, you know, lounging down, nothing really like risque about it. I used that as a thumbnail art um, for it. And then when I woke up, the thumbnail art had been replaced with like a weird lion guy with the chimera of the boss. I was like, okay, um, I don't know what happened there. Let me just quickly go fix it then. I go to go fix it. Um, I put a completely new art because I'm like, well, maybe that was just a little bit too much. I go put it the new art, which is just like literally from the art of, uh, I think it's from, it might be from the next summer event. It might be summer three where it's Naito, Sheba, and uh, Sherazade dancing in a club. I put an extreme close up on that one and I made it that and I was like, okay, that's not bad. Literally nothing's going bad here. I get another <laughs> takedown from it. And at this point, YouTube sends me an email and is like, by the way, we think that you might be breaking some kind of rules with this <laughs> thumbnail art. And I was like, dude, what? This is insane. <laughs> I ended up sending them a, um, the reason I think it's insane is because I've used ten times more uh, risky art for my thumbnails for specifically fade videos. Um, if you look back at, I think, last year's Nero Fest, my brother, uh, literally, I think, started shit-talking me, uh, 
friendly shit-talking me over the use of Nero on my thumbnail because he said it was clickbait and I said whatever that's just good art and that's her literally in her outfit there so don't, why don't you shut the hell up um, there's another one with Kiara that has very messed up art which I can tell you right now that art was done by a hentai artist at some point if that ends up getting taken down now that I've revealed that that's fine with me I'll find another Kiara or just put it back up who cares um, I'll tell them that there's nothing wrong with it. Because in all honesty, there's really nothing wrong with the art. I don't understand. But the point is, is that I put all this other stuff, that stuff, ten times more risque than what is basically just Sherazade and Naito dancing. So, I look at it, and I'm going like, I cannot believe that they're doing it specifically to them. I have no idea why they felt like these two ladies together have been so bad. And now that I think about it, I don't think I've ever put two uh, fate ladies together on the same thumbnail. I don't think I've done that before. So I ended up sending them... Um, they were like, you can um, fight back on this. So I fought back on it and I was like, okay, first of all, here's the three things that you said are bad for thumbnails. It can be either violent, pornographic, or... I forgot the last thing, but it's something else. Ooh, bond level up. Yay. You gotta take a screenshot of that. Yeah play a lot she just recently this is i think that's the fastest i've ever gotten a unit to um uh, uh to, to bond six that was not a um a four or a five or a four or a three unit i mean uh anyway or was not quets actually no quets 100 percent got quicker to level to bond six than any other unit <laughs> Okay, I was hoping they were gonna say something cool, but they didn't say anything cool. Boo. Uh, yes, this one's perfect. So anyway, I sent them that, and I told them like, listen, there were three specific rules. This literally doesn't violate any of them. I told them literally, all they're doing is dancing. They're just two ladies being together. There's nothing wrong in it. Um, waited an entire day, and I think the thumbnail is still up, so maybe someone at YouTube... They did say in, like, the email specifically, like, hey, we were dealing some shit with, due to COVID, so maybe we accidentally took this down. If so, then just contact us, but I was, like, borderline steaming, because I was like, what the hell is YouTube doing? What the hell do they think they're doing? There's nothing wrong with this picture. And I was starting to wonder, like, the only thing that was different about them was that they were one together and two, they were a um, uh, different color of skin from the other ones. But I think it's obviously not that. Um, it would be real fucked up if it was that. I sure hope it's not that. Jesus. Imagine if it was that? No, thank you. I do not want to think about that. But it should be fine now. I put up one of Nero with, um, uh, in her swimsuit. Yeah, uh, from the uh, story event where I read the beauty contest, which was a but which was a ton of fun for me to record. I just realized I used this skill too damn early. That's fine. Uh, the thing I was gonna say about that video, which was really funny, I think that's the fastest I've ever actually gotten a dislike on a video. <laughs> it was the, the, the previous video I did about the beauty contest, because all it is is just me reading. It's something I like to occasionally do with uh, Fate, but it was pretty funny because I was like, all right. One like, and then I think literally like two minutes later, there was a second dislike, and I was like, all right, this is officially now the most hotly contested video that I have at 50-50, but it's, it's, it's gotten better now. I think it's like at 80% or something, but I was like laughing at that. I was like, this is pretty funny. I think that's the fastest I've ever seen someone leave a dislike on something. And so if you're wondering, like, oh man, does Woki pay attention when I leave a like or do anything or leave a comment? The answer is, yeah, I do. I pay attention to all of it. Um, kind of because my phone tells me, but yeah, I pay attention. I look at what you guys do. Uh, trying to make that sound as uncreepy as possible. I fucked up last turn, so yeah, she's not going to kill. I needed to. I used all my skills early, so that's 100% uh, my bad on that one. I think she'll get him here. I sure hope she gets him here, otherwise we're gonna have some real big-ass problems. Yeah, she got him. She got him. Good job, good job, good job. But yeah, I think that's the end of today's video. Thank you very much, everyone, for watching this. If you ended up liking it, remember, 
always hit that like button and hit that sub button if you want some more fate stuff from me i also played dragalia lost and a whole bunch of other gacha games um and in general games i played a mighty Morphin power ranger game at one point which i kind of want to play more of and i'll you know stay tuned for that maybe uh for all the seven people who like my mighty Morphin power ranger stuff <laughs> Anyway, I'm leaving these boos behind. Thank you everyone for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace and have a good night.